The most overpowered route I have found so far. Hi there, I'm Golden Rods, and today we'll be taking a look at the most overpowered route I have found so far. Uh, this route, you can get literally just about all of the rousings, uh, rousing elements, however you want to see it. But for the most part, here is the route. And I'm going to explain to you how it works because it doesn't work like other routes. So what you have to do is you have to be in war mode. That's so you can get the rousing eerie or ire. I keep calling it eerie, and I don't know why. But you got your rousing ire from the war mode. Then you will want seeds if you are in herbalist. Um, unfortunately, you won't be able to get all of the rousing elements if you don't go with herbalism. However. Um, if you do, then you'll want propagating seeds. I'd highly recommend buying them off the auction house for cheap if you can find them cheap enough. And we will show you why here in just a second. Um, but for now, let's go ahead and talk about my website. So my website, um, it has all of the routes I have posted up on it so far. Um, I can't say all of the routes that I have for Dragonflight yet because I haven't actually uploaded all of them yet. So be on the lookout for some new routes on the website. The website is in the description below so be sure to go check it out if you are curious about why um, why you should be checking it out. Well if you have the add-on routes and you want this route in your add-on then it's easy to copy the code from my website and put it into the add-on as opposed to trying to trace the route by hand so there's a lot going on in this route and as we can see here I've got a ton of the rousing elements I've got some over here as well now I didn't pick all of this up from this route unfortunately I've picked up probably two three hundred of the wrist bark though I will say that and a good portion of the rousings and awakened elements so you're probably wondering how you can get the rousing decay well again through herbalism um, you can either plant the decayed rouse seedling so what you could do is you could swap back and forth between your propagating seeds and decayed seeds which I don't recommend buying like 50 to 100 of in either seed you know I don't recommend buying that many I just have that many because I know I'm going to use them and I love farming and I love using them but as we just saw there I used a propagating seed it spawned I think it was four nodes you can have it spawn up to six nodes which is really nice and five I found out yesterday that five out of the six can be Rithbark so I'm hoping to get a six of six someday that would be kinda cool but for now the most amount of Rithbark you can get from one is five which is a lot guys like I don't I hope you guys understand how good that is but yeah that's the most overpowered route I have found so far so thanks for watching don't forget to give the video a thumbs up and I hope you enjoy the rest of your day